Hi guys, it's Camille again. Um, just going to uh, show you a little thing that we've um, worked on uh, yesterday actually. Uh, we just basically implemented a quick benchmark so you can, um, you can start comparing how these devices work. Uh, still need to implement um, you know, texture compression and a whole bunch of other optimizations. So this is quite pre pre preliminary. But this is um, this is how it runs on the Ouya, and I'll um, uh, after the video I'll also post up uh, how it runs on some of the other devices. Uh, basically, all this does is it spawns in um, mobs constantly until it, um, the frame rate just becomes completely unacceptable. Um, you're never going to have these many mobs on screen at once, and they're all active; they're all attacking you. Um, so it's full AI. It, it, it's, it's a good scaling test. Um, uh, any mobs that aren't on screen aren't actually going to be um, hitting this so hard. So you can see on the Ouya, we've got um, not not that many frames above 30 frames a second. And as soon as we kind of hit um, 34 mobs, that's the last time we see 30 frames. Um, and we we already start seeing under 12 and under 8 kind of when we get to 30-ish uh, and um, mid-50s respectively. Um, to show you the other one, just hold on, and here we have the same test on the HTC One X. I won't make you get, sit through the entire thing, um, but you can see we can actually get a fair few more mobs on there before on screen at once, um, before it starts causing problems. So. Um, uh, if, I don't know if you follow the other blogs, but um, there is a, a frame delay that I've picked up on the on the Ouya, and it also affects the transformer, uh, the T101s. Um, I'm currently working on that, and um, I'm I believe implementing texture compression, a few other um, things like that should improve performance greatly. But now that we've got a baseline, we can see what it is, and we can see the fruits of our labour. So, till next time, I'm Camille. See ya.